System Setup. Place the MBBR in its final position on the campsite on level ground. Set the remote sump at an appropriate location on the rig site where the wastewater can flow to the sump by gravity. Make sure the sump is on level ground with the bottom at least two meters below ground level. The sump must be less than 600 meters away from the MBBR tank. Set the collection sump at an appropriate location on the campsite. Make sure the sump is on level ground with the bottom at least two meters below ground level. This tank must be less than 20 meters away from the MBBR tank. Make sure all wastewater lines at the rig site are connected to one main four inch line, which feeds the remote sump by gravity. Make sure the pipe is properly vented. Make sure all wastewater lines at the campsite are connected to one main four inch line which feeds the collection by gravity. Make sure the pipe is properly vented. Connect the collection tank to the MBBR blue tank to the two inch connection under the stairs using the two inch black hose provided. Connect the remote sump to the MBBR to the other two inch connection under the stairs using the two inch blue flat hose provided. Connect as many 100 meter sections of blue flat hose together as needed. Make sure the two inch PVC discharge line is connected Install a 2-inch ball valve with male cam lock fitting onto the drain of the Dyna Disc filter tank. Connect a temporary discharge line using the 2-inch blue flat hose and female cam lock fitting. Run the hose next to the 2-inch PVC discharge line and wire tie it loosely to the pipe for support as needed. Connect 220 volt, three phase, 60 hertz power to the MBBR tank. Connect 220 volt power to the local sump from the MBBR control panel. Connect 220 volt, three phase, 60 hertz to the remote sump. Finish the setup of the MBBR tank. Install all handrails. Make sure EQ pumps are connected and set in place vertically in the proper location. Install mixer shaft and impellers. Confirm that all biomedia is in the aeration tank only. Remove biomedia from all other tanks and put back into the aeration tank. Confirm chain is properly installed on DynaDisc filter drive. Confirm the bottom of clarifier V-notch weir elevation is 0.35 meters below the top of the tank with gasket properly in place. The weir must be level. Close all valves in the plant. Remove all trash and debris from all tanks. Check control room for any loose items or wires. 